Hello friends, my name is Anubhav and today we are going to learn mouse cursor hovering in Selenium WebDriver. So first of all, we have to use the actions class. We are going to use web element class and a method move to element method. Okay, let's start. First of all, let's just create the driver object. Now, there are two errors, just mouse over it and import. So, wait and import. So, what is web driver? Web driver is interface. What is Chrome driver? driver is a class and you know the concept class is implements interfaces okay now by using the object of driver object we are gonna open the website by using get method we'll pass the string as a URL of the page to which we want to automate so what we have done in this step, we have just opened the website by using get method. Okay. Now, what we have to do right now is pass the script into a thread because loading website will take some time to load okay sorry it is not a string it will only take numerical values now let's create let's find the element to locate that what element we want to locate so by dot id and we will pass the id which we want to mouse over so I want to mouse over over here. So just click here and point your mouse here and click again and just copy the ID and just paste the ID inside these quotations. What we have done in, th in this step, we have located the web element. Now further, let's keep it in a variable in element variable and the return type of this element variable would be web element okay mouse over it and import now let's just use actions class this is a special type of class which is just used to handle mouse hovering features and we'll pass driver object inside the constructor of this class the reason being that the action variable will be able to use driver object also and itself also now moving ahead we will use method move to method move to element and element dot build okay friends build and perform methods are default methods of actions class we have to use these methods every time we are using mouse interactions let's run our project and let's see what happens Okay, bang, it's working. Thank you guys. See you next tutorial.